Hi, this is Lynn from FromABookshelf.com, and today I want to talk about the book Farewell to Manzanar. At least I think that's how you say it. This book is about Japanese internment camp during World War II. This is a part of U.S. history that not a lot of people talk about. In fact, some people don't even know about it. I learned a little bit about this growing up, but not a lot. I feel like this is a book everyone needs to read in school. This should be required reading. Is one of those books that's just a powerful part of history that we need to remember. We are not proud of history. This is not something the U.S. should be proud of doing, but it is part of our history we need to know and remember so that we do not repeat it. This is the story of um, the author's story of it's a memoir of um, her family being put into an internment camp. It starts before the war and then being put in the internment camp and then follows her family through the camp and then um, what happened to them afterwards. She, it was written in 1973, so she was an adult when she wrote it, but the book is written through the eyes of a child and her life of how she viewed it then. It is a fascinating read. It is not that big of a book. It didn't take me that long to read it. It is a book that I have meant to read for years, but just finally got around to reading it, and I wish I had read it a long time ago. And um, I've read a couple books recently on Japanese internment camps during World War II, and it's kind of started me on a trail of reading more and learning about this time period in history. I've read a lot about Europe during World War II, but um, not a lot about the Japanese internment camps in the U.S., and I want to learn more. If you are like me and you're wanting to know more about this time period, highly recommend Farewell to Manzanar.